What's up guys, today in this video we will see how to create these 4 amazing music video effect inside Filmora 12. So without any delay let's start today's tutorial. First let's jump into first effect tutorial. First split the clip at desired time, then take a snapshot, drop snapshot on track 2, then go to the AI tools and use smart cutout to isolate the subject. Now if I hide track 1 you will see we have only subject on track 2. Now shift snapshot 8 frames back then split it after 10 frames and delete rest of the snapshot. Place the playhead at start, go to the basic and change rotation to negative 84, change x to negative 147 and y to negative 786. On position and rotation keyframe. Then go 5 frames further and reset the position and rotation. Then go to the transitions and apply shutter glass transition on track 1 and keep transition for 10 frames. And our first effect is ready. Let's render it to see the preview. This is how you can create this effect very easily. Let's jump into second effect tutorial. Split the clip at desired point, then split it after 16 frames. Press and hold Alt key and drag it upward to duplicate it on track 2. Then place it on track 5. Again isolate the subject. Copy and paste it on track 4. Go to the basic. On transform keyframes. Then after 5 frames set rotation to negative 18 and adjust its position. After 4 frames, add blank keyframe, then at the end, reset the position and rotation. Duplicate track 5 clip on track 3. Make start point of track 3 clip after 2 frames on transform keyframe, then after 5 frames, change rotation to negative 25 and adjust its position. Then after 2 frames, add blank keyframe. Then at the end reset the position and rotation. Again copy and paste it on track 2. Make it 4 frames short from start. Add transform keyframes. After 5 frames set rotation at negative 42. Adjust its position. At the end reset the position and rotation. Then apply directional blur on all 3 tracks. You can see how it looks. Now create the keyframe for directional blur to control the blur amount during the start point like 0 at start and after 1 frame set it to 10. Then at hold point 1 frame before hold add blank keyframe and then after 1 frame set blur amount to 0 and on exit point set blur amount to 10. Do the same on track 3 and 4 clip. So now our second effect is ready. Now let's render it to see the preview. Easy and simple effect. Let's jump into third effect tutorial. Split the clip at desired point. Then split it again after 3 frames. Press and hold Alt key to duplicate it on track 2. After 2 frames take a snapshot. Then shift the part and place it at the end point on previous track 1 clip. Then change scale to 0 on transform keyframe and after 2 frames reset the scale. Now drop the snapshot on track 3 right above the split clip. Then place it 4 frames before the split clip and isolate the subject by using AI portrait. At start unlink the scale and change x to 0 and y to 99.90. On transform keyframe. Then after 6 frames reset scale to 100. Then delete this split clip and join the clips. Split snapshot and delete it. Now let's render it to see the preview. Let's jump into last effect tutorial. Split the clip and duplicate it on track 2. 
Then place the duplicate clip at a desired starting point of effect and split it at the end point and delete the rest of the part. Then place track 1 clip on track 3 to get the reference and reduce its duration and place it back on track 1. Now you can see when we play the clip it play in sequence. Select track 2 clip and isolate the subject and adjust its position. Go to the transitions and apply simple rule 11 transition on track 1 and keep the transition for 14 frames. Then at start add transform keyframe and place the subject to the right side of the screen. Then go 4 frames further and place it on the left side of the screen. Go 1 frame further and place it on the subject on background. Then go 1 frame further and place it according to the background subject. Then again go 1 frame further and place it according to the movement of background. Do the same till the end of the transition. That's it. Let's render it to see the preview. Cool and easy simple roll effect. Now let's see all four effects together. That's it guys. This is how you can create these four amazing music video effect inside Filmora 12. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you all in my next video. Till then, stay safe. Goodbye.